What's up guys, Cole Townsend here. Today, we're back out at Evergreen, setting it, we got the E36 out here. Uh, got the tires on, we went through tech, everything's good to go. We're gonna go out today and try and do some tandems, but uh, it's supposed to rain, so I'm not sure how close we're gonna be able to get, just cause I don't wanna tow the car. But we're gonna send it. Stoked because it's raining, we're gonna be able to do the big bank in third gear without having to clutch kick like four times. So that's gonna be great, but I'll keep you guys updated throughout the day. I'm gonna really try to work on my handwork today and like throwing the wheel back when I'm uh, transitioning instead of just like all like tripping over myself and my hands are going so fast. Okay guys, we are about to go up for our first lap on track. Uh, the mount, I forgot the other screws. The GoPro just gonna be like sitting in it, but hopefully it'll be fine, I don't know. It kind of hits a little bit right here when I turn my head, but uh, we're gonna send it. I still need to get an actual race helmet, but uh, it's gonna be fun. I don't know how much of that you guys saw, but coming off the bank, it is straight glass. There's no traction at all. So I, I did the whole bank, came off the bank, and it was just like, no, nope, you're done. Uh, I might put different tires in the front because these might understeer too much, so I need more traction up front. guys so we just did another lap everything felt really good that lap compared to the first one um but now we're gonna go ahead and do the tech course really quick go over there check the tires because they felt like they were already gone and that was two laps i doubt they are it could just be like they were chirping a lot but i don't know Okay guys, we are going back out on track right now. I just had to switch my tires up because they delaminated. I saw a lot of life left, but it kind of sucks, but they did just delaminate. Uh, I'm gonna throw the GoPro on the roof. It's probably gonna get some water on it. I'm sorry, but that's how it is. I've been getting insanely close with tandems with Jonah. It's great. So uh, he's a few cars up right now, so I'm gonna try and get up with him after this lap. Uh, just figure out this new course, because I've never done it. We're starting on the 5.8s. This is the bank that the FD guys run. Like they're grinding their back ends on that wall. But anyways, I'm gonna throw the camera up on the roof. Let's have some more fun.
CrossFit some more tan from Jonah. That last one, he was kind of a mile off me, but uh, <laughs> Dude, come on. we're getting comfortable. I like trust him not to like bang my door in. So yeah, we got really close. So he thinks it's gonna happen. It, it probably will, but I'm gonna get another E36 first to smash. Anyways guys, we're gonna go out and we're taking his car out over there. And we're taking on the tech course. And yeah, I'll put his Instagram right here. So check him out. We're gonna go send it. Jonah's car. It's so different without having like the angle kit. I spun out a few times and I followed some else and the space spun out. Uh, he also has a 391 diff, so it's a lot more torquey at the low end and like the acceleration's a lot, like a lot more than mine. And then um, you have to shift a lot more. Like my car, you stay in second gear the whole track. His car, you do third and at the very end, I, I went to second. But it's a sick car. Uh, if it had the angle kit, it's gonna be amazing. But he drove mine, he was like, damn, I need an angle kit now. So. Anyways, we're gonna head back out there, do some close tandems, and just send it.
I've been doing pretty good. We're hitting the three eighths right now. Um, now that I'm not having anyone ride along with me, I'm actually being able to hit the three eighths no problem. Uh, I don't know how good this angle is. I'm trying to get like the hand work in there. Uh, it's really like key for me to try and get that better because like I see like Adam LZ's video or Taylor Ray's video and they're like really clean with the way like they're moving their hands and that's like my goal I want to be able to do that and like control the car better without being so fidgety and drift and uh, try and like hold a steadier line without like changing like rapidly my angle so yeah that's the goal let's keep setting I think we're almost done it's uh 450 it is starting to rain now and it was supposed to rain all day so we kind of got lucky because we got a drift without the rain um in the rain you do save tire but I'm more about learning how to like get better at drifting and you're not going to get better if you're always drifting in the rain, in my opinion at least. We are headed out of the drift event right now. The car is fully packed. It's, it's not easy getting all that stuff in here. This is the first time where when I'm going home, one of my friends didn't come out to like take all my sh So it was hard to get it all back in because everything's wet and stuff. So anyways, we're headed out. That Today was amazing. Like I have never done tandems that close and I'm so stoked with how much I'm improving. Uh, having Jonah uh, to tandem with was a big help. He has that uh, blue and black E36 that you have you probably has that blue and black E36. You guys have probably seen him in my other videos. Uh, he's always following me. And now today I really started like saying like, yo, I'm a chase. And I just, before I wasn't confident enough to do it. And holy crap, like I improved a lot today. I'm getting really close to people and like left foot braking and that kind of stuff. So anyways, I'll put his Instagram right here. Go give him a follow. He's a good drifter. He's gonna be building a cooler car soon to uh, just go harder in because he drove my car and he was like, wow, like, I need an angle kit now. So anyways, we're headed home guys. I think that's gonna be it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And